Well, hello again, everybody, and welcome to the Student Achievement Center. My name is Steve Lapello, and I'm here with my amazing videographer, Tricia. And we are today going to give you an update on the progress of the renovation work that we've been doing over the past year. Um, it's been a spectacular change. We hope that you like it. And we're starting with the front door and just scanning through the front facade of the building. And you can see what an improvement it is with new windows, um, a new entryway, um, just an overall completely different look and appearance to the building. Uh, the building itself will be ready for the first week of classes, which is in the middle of August of 2019. We're very excited to open this up to our students and, and to the community. Let's take a look inside. We recognize that our students are in need of technology services and we wanted to make that prominent as people enter the building. And our students really oftentimes need help with technology here at the college. So we built a space specifically designed for the college's help desk personnel uh, to work and to be able to assist students with all of their technology needs, whether they need to connect to our Wi-Fi, have an issue with their laptop or their phone, whatever the case may be, we'll have people here willing, able, and ready to help them at all times. What we're looking at now are the shelves of individual study spaces for students. Um, we felt it necessary in connection with our Learning Resource Center that students had an opportunity to collaborate with one another. So these areas that you're looking at now are group study areas and we're very excited to bring that to students to allow them to collaborate with one another and in fact they can even collaborate with their instructors or anyone else uh, with whom they choose. We've also included um, for student use uh, private study areas and this is an example of what one looks like with the slate desk and the light overhead. Um, we felt it was an efficient way for students to be able to spend quiet time. Again, everything being connected to the Learning Resource Center for students to come in here to, be, to have a private place to study and a quiet place to study if so needed. What you're looking at now is our cafe, our Wesley's Cafe as we call it. Um, we took painstaking measures to make this as friendly for students as possible. I think you can see by the, the tile work and the woodwork that's associated with this. This is a very special place and we wanted to make it that way for students as, as we have in every space here um, in this brand, brand new renovated area. Um, we're excited about the possibilities of this. It will be a full service cafe with sandwiches, salads, soups, um, beverages, pretty much anything students would want we could make here um, for them. We've installed some uh, very efficient and stylish lighting here um, in, in this part of our project. Uh, we're very pleased with the outcome of this installation. And you can see by the colors on the wall, we're carrying the color theme of the college through the design. And what we're looking at now, as we scan down, is the, enter the entryway into the enrollment center. And the enrollment center for the college was designed to be a one-stop shop for the students. So anything that was student-related, whether it was a financial aid matter, a registration matter, uh, uh, the ability to see their counselor, or to even make a payment on their account, we wanted to make a space available for students where they didn't have to go from one office to another or one department to another, that they could do everything within the confines of one general area of the building. And they will be able to do that with this enrollment center. The room we're now looking at is a public meeting room and by that when we recruit students we needed to create a space to allow for presentations to be made and for large groups uh, to meet. Um, this space accommodates that. Um, it, you can tell by the size of it that it has ample, ample space and ample opportunity to uh, prepare and present uh, presentations to, to those students that we are recruiting. This space was designed as a computer lab and we fully intend to utilize it. Our students have great needs in regards to, to computer labs. Um, many of our students don't have the access to a computer at home, so we, we will be providing that here as part of this space. What you're looking at now is a meeting room, um, essential for us to collaborate as employees. You can tell that it's a meeting room by the distinct carpeting and color pattern associated with this room. 
As I had mentioned with the meeting group, you can see the distinction of an office. This is a, a general office that will be part of the enrollment center. Um, very well appointed. We'll have all the necessary technology for us as employees to effectively perform our jobs. This just gives you an idea of what a, a typical corridor looks like in the enrollment center. Um, we're going to deviate from this shot and go into the space that's going to eventually uh, take us into where the faculty offices will be located. Okay, the space we've entered into now is the space that will be occupied by faculty. And the way this whole space was designed, it, was, it had a twofold purpose. One, the faculty offices that you see with the, the glazing over the, over the glass are two-person occupancy spaces. The reason for that is we wanted the faculty to better collaborate with one another. As a final part of what, we're, what our plans are for this space, we wanted to bring as much natural lighting into the space as possible. So we had installed a series of skylights that directly reflect along the wall that enters into the enrollment center. And it does bring in a host of natural light. And we're very pleased with the way that's turned out. We've also added brand new landscaping to accentuate the beauty of the building. There are over 1,100 plants that have been planted to support the look, the overall look, the aesthetic appeal that we're trying to um, deliver for um, everybody that comes to see this beautiful building.